So what you can also do is to get exact look of the photos that you want, you can use advanced photo editing settings. So to access that out, you need to go around onto edit image right here. And over here, you can see uh, advanced settings right here. For example, you can work around with the brightness right here. You can just click and drag it out and it changes around the brightness level of the picture that you're selecting. You can also go around over here and type in the value of the brightness. So let's say, for example, a number or a negative number to decrease out the brightness right here. So let me just go around and increase out the brightness just like this. Apart from that, you got the contrast option as well that increases the difference between black and white right here. You can also change around the brightness, increase around the contrast just like this or decrease around the contrast according to how you want right here. You can also work around with the tint to change around the overall color look of the image as you can see right here to make it more green or make it more uh, blue or purple as you can see right here. You can increase and decrease the saturation of the uh, uh, image right here by clicking and dragging the saturation as well. You can completely remove out the color uh, right here from an image by using the saturation option as well. You can also change around the blur level of the image as you can see by increasing, uh, increasing the blur amount. Then you have the X process uh, option which uh, changes out let's say the uh, uh, yeah, yeah, yellow stone on your picture so you can add in yellow tone and you can also go around add in a vignette that means the uh, uh, black uh, um, uh, black uh, 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 shades over here on the edges right here that is the vignette you can revert it back to original as well in fact when you go around and choose any filter and change around the filter intensity what it is doing is it is uh, adjusting out the advanced settings right here but more with a preset right here. So you can go around over here and change around the settings like individual settings and then the filter gets removed as you can see right here. Then you can go around, change the look of the picture according to how you want to get the effect that you want um, uh, by using these settings to get the look on the pic uh, picture as you like. So that is how you can use the advanced photo editing settings inside of Vista Create projects for photos. So I hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.